Well, Minister of Works and Family Island Affairs, the Honorable Clay Sweeting is dismissing claims of a Bahamian man that his All Saints Way shanty town home was wrongfully demolished last week. And this after the man says he notified officials who proceeded with demolition. But Sweeting says a vigorous assessment would have occurred before the home was knocked down. In order to build a home, first you should own the property. So if you don't, if, if you build a home on somebody's property that isn't yours, first of all, it's illegal in, in that respect. Now we did have instances where persons who applied to build a home, um, requested a permit, requested a permit to build a home and the location was different than the location they built the home on. And in that case, the Ministry of Works did not give any occupancy certificate. So those homes that got approval to build are being assessed. Asked if the individual would be compensated if a mistake were made, he says that person would first have to make an appeal and the situation would have to be assessed. We put notices at um, that location from October. So um, they were in touch with Mr. Craig Delancey at the Ministry of Works. Anyone that had an issue, we told them to appeal. Um, but, but no one that I'm aware um, at a conveyance, and, and the person that did have a conveyance um, was a home at uh, Cool Acres, and that home was, is still left standing if you go to that location. Um, she proved that she owned the property. She bought the property from the individual. They had a conveyance on the property. Um, so that home is still left standing at that location. So I, I seriously doubt um, that it w a house would have been knocked down um, in, in, in that issue. Hi there, I'm Corval Pyfram. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things Zed and S.